Okay, here's a real quick video on installing some Amazon $16 flip out uh, mirrors. I'll put the link down below in the description for these, but they're $16 shipped and they look identical to the Rottweiler performance ones. So let me show you what you get for the $16. You get a really nice high quality billet aluminum side mirror. And then you get uh, bar end uh, mounts. And I will show you how I'm going to duplicate what uh, Rottweiler Performance does to mount them on the hand guards. Because uh, my friend has the exact Rottweiler Performance and these look identical to them. The only difference is the mount. So I will show you how to do this. So when you take the bar end mount apart, these are the pieces you have. You have the billet aluminum end piece, and then you have the inserts for your uh, bars and a bolt. So we're not gonna use any of that. We're just gonna use this end piece. And then I made a bracket just out of uh, two mil steel, and I just sprayed it black. Um, I'll show you a picture of how it starts in the video, but then I'm going to mount that onto that and then this side with the two holes will be bolted to the hand guards and I'm going to do this on my 690 rally uh, as a test. So the only difference I can find between this mirror kit and this, this is glass by the way, it's not uh, chrome plastic or anything. Um, the only difference I can find is in the mount. So the Rottweiler one uh, has a solid welded piece or a machined piece of 5 mil aluminum uh, with this mounting bracket welded to it or formed to it. Um, and mine, I'm going to use some nuts and bolts. Um, and I did find the Rottweiler exact same version on another website for sale without the Rottweiler logo on it for a quarter of the price of the Rottweiler performance ones. So I'm going to try to do it for, I think this would end up being 5% of the price, you know, $16 plus a dollar or two and screws and bolts and a little bit of paint. So uh, an M6 button head screw will fit perfectly in this spacing and have just enough to, it has about three mils on the bottom in order to go through the bracket. Um, you could use, you know, obviously use uh, M6 by 20 if you want. Uh, and this is just a test. If I decide I like the mirrors where they're at, I might go ahead and just uh, uh, make a billet piece to avoid having a nut on the inside of the handguard or on the outside. But uh, let me mount these and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, I switched it for an M5 button head. I have the button, uh, the bolt coming in through the inside of the handguard. And then I have a, a nylon uh, nut on the inside that I've managed to get into the aluminum or the aluminum bracket mount. So that's how it'll go when I'm done with it. That I'm happy with so far. And here is what it'll look like with the mirror mounted on it. I'm not sure what position I'll run the mirror in, but it will rotate forward, back. Um, it's totally adjustable. Just like the Rottweiler, you know, it's 360. You can move it around. Uh, let me see if it's loose enough for me to do one-handed. Yeah, there we go. So, you know, you can move it however you want and set it up. So I am going to go ahead and mount it and then play with it. Okay, here's the finished product. I just threaded it into the plastic handguard. It's actually pretty sturdy, but I'll, I'll probably put uh, lock nuts on the outside of it. But 
that's it. Here's the old one, and here's the new one. And, you know, you can move it, adjust it, however you want. Uh, I'll need to ride it for a bit on, and get the exact orientation I want, but that's it. So that's, uh, I am pretty happy with that. And it, you don't get any, I won't have any problem. It doesn't get in my way at all. So that's what, that's what's good. Here's the finished product, both sides. I like it, looks good, nice and slick. So a really uh, inexpensive way to get flip out mirrors, again the link will be down below in the description. Any questions leave me a comment and I will respond. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And it really helps us out, and we appreciate it. Keeps us making these videos.